hello everyone welcome back to another vlog um i am about to run into louis vuitton out here in market street and get my perfume bottle hot stamped so let's go in here and do that and then i'm gonna run to um whole food and grab a few things that i need to get because I am making lamb chops for dinner tonight. Um, and that's pretty much it. So let's go into Louis Vuitton. I was this close to changing the scent, but I was like, you know what? I don't like to exchange or return anything. Um, my husband gets me, so I don't like it. I mean, it smells good. Um, so I'm fine. It, sm it still smells good. The other smell really good, so I'm fine with that. Um, but my next bottle I get will be... Um, Apogee or a Trappy Ravis, a Trappy Ravis or Corbaton. That's my next that's my next little three lineup that I have. <laughs> but now we are going to run to Whole Food and get back in the back. Um grab a few things and then we're going to head home because right after this I have to pick up the kids from school. I still have a little bit of time, but we're gonna pick up the kids from school today and make us some dinner. So I'll see y'all in a little bit. It is hot out here. My shirt is thin, but it's hot. It's 80 degrees. It's not as humid as it was. It was cooler earlier this morning. Um, but yeah, I am gonna head home. Try to prep my lamb chops because I'm sure they're still frozen. Um but yeah that's what we're gonna head and go do I haven't been to the woodlands in weeks uh, I haven't been out here in weeks so it's my first time out here since uh, the middle of December uh, the reason being uh my dad used to have to come out here for dialysis and it was just like the car rides here was bringing back you know all the memories which they're good memories and you at least you have that to hold on to but we all miss him because it's still fresh so i have not come out here since then but i'm okay today so all right guys i have made it back home i am about to show y'all my um hot stamping i got on my perfume soon as i find somewhere to set y'all up <laughs> do not know where i put my mouth so let's go see if i can find that oh here it is in my room um, um, as soon as I get it open, give me a second. It looks so 
dark. No. Okay. That's ugh, got my whole food bag in the That is better. So let me show y'all the finished product. I went to the Louis Vuitton on Market Street and I can't remember her name. Chris Chris My sister knows all of them up there. Um, I'll insert her name if you guys want to go. She's so nice. Uh, but I got the spell on you as I showed y'all the other day. And that is my monogramy. My hot stamp anyway. I hot stamp like almost everything I buy from them. I'm trying to put my shirt as the background so y'all can see. So cute. So cute. Because I was thinking, she asked me if I wanted to put the um, the periods between it. And I was like, everything else, majority of everything else that I have, um, it doesn't have periods between it. Um, I think my wallet does. I'm not sure. But, yeah. I am excited about this. I think it came out really cute. So, my daughter asked me to make spaghetti and meatballs for dinner tonight so that's what i will be cooking for them i'm gonna have um some lamb chops and that's probably it that's all i'll be having today so let me um relax my nerves for about a good almost 30 minutes before i head to go pick my kids up from school and hear mama mama this mama that mama this mama this all day so, actually, let me show y'all what I got from Whole Foods. I love their spicy guacamole. Even though I can make my own, but I did not feel like it. So, I bought some. These puffy Dutch pancake bites for the kids. These gooey, ooey cake. Gooey butter cake, my bad. Pure cranberry juice. And I've got three seasons that I'm out of. I think I'm going to do what Happy Silas Mama did. She bought what I just needed. I think onion powder, oregano, and garlic powder. But uh, what she does is take off these labels and she replaces them with the labels that she bought from um, Amazon. So I think I'm going to do that because it looks cute and it is way cheaper than me buying bottles to pour this out of and put it in the other one. So I'm gonna just keep these, because I mean, they're just plain black bottles. And if I show y'all what's in this cabinet, it's a lot going on in here and I'm trying to work it down. So <laughs> I'm trying to work it down, but anyway. Hey y'all, so before we end this vlog, I wanted to show y'all um, what I got from the Tap of the Brown launch for Target. So I showed y'all a little short I uploaded the other day, uh, but I wanna show y'all the things and tell you how they taste, which I haven't tasted all of them yet, but we gonna see. So first we have this very cute water bottle. When they have the ones, y'all know that's on uh, Amazon, they kind of look like this, they're not this big, but I thought this was so cute. It says, hello there, you got this and very good. And it's 30, 34 ounces, uh, which is good. You're supposed to have what? Eight cups a day, six, four ounces? Okay. Fill this up twice a day, or you can do more. So I bought this because I thought it was so cute. Um, this is the vegan strawberry cream cheese spread. And when I tell y'all, I had this on, I have just the plain bagels, but I usually get, uh, the Dave's cinnamon raisin, but I know it tastes really good. I've never had vegan cream cheese, uh, but it's very good. So y'all should give this a try, definitely. Um, sweet and salty popcorn. So I bought two bags of this yesterday. My kids have almost finished the other bag of this. Um, and my sister, she has to come pick hers up, but 
I bought two of these and it is actually very good. It's not like, it doesn't feel like oily as a lot of popcorns, which I stopped really buying other popcorns. The only one I buy is Lesser Evil, the Himalayan um, sweetness, I think, or sea salt. I buy the plain sea salt and then the Himalayan sweetness is the only two I get from that brand. But this one is really good. So if y'all can get your hands on it, go ahead and give it a try. Um, I also bought the roasted garlic and Parmesan, which for people, I love Parmesan. I love garlic. I love, I do like it, but I'm glad I bought two bags of the sweet and saucy versus this one because I wanted it to have more of a um, garlic flavor, but I you definitely taste it, but I, I'm like a garlic lover. So my garlic and everybody else's garlic may not be the same, but it's still, it's really good. And lastly is, I actually ordered this yesterday because I saw on YouTube, Sharika B uploaded on Instagram. Um, she had this with some lime tortilla chips. So I ordered it yesterday, picked it up today. It is the vegan lemon garlic dill hummus, which I am a hummus fan. I eat hummus. I usually get, uh, what's the brand called? I get the boar's head, um, the red chili, the red spicy chili one. I get the spicy chili garlic or red chili garlic. That's when I get, I eat it with, uh, I usually eat it with cucumbers or carrots. But this one, Sharika B paired with lime tortilla chips. So I got the, I think it's siete. Siete. Oh, focus. Siete green free tortilla chips in lime flavor. So I am gonna give these a try uh, today, but I do already eat hummus, so I'm pretty sure this is very good. I've never had lemon garlic dill though. I only eat either plain just hummus or I get the sweet, uh, the spicy garlic one, but I'm excited to try this. So that is all the items that I picked up from Let's have the brown one. So guys, here are the meatballs that are for the kids' spaghetti tonight. And these are the lamb chops that I'm about to cook for myself. I'm gonna cut them um, first and then season them. But this is it and I'll show y'all the finished product when I'm done. I only use uh, ground turkey, two packs. Well, no, this is one pack, I'm sorry. One pack of ground turkey, uh, two eggs, some breadcrumbs, garlic powder, onion powder, salt, pepper, and paprika. And a little bit of, what up in here? Uh, Trader Joe's onion salt. That's what the little green is in there. But that is it. They asked for meatballs and spaghetti tonight, so that's what they'll have. I'll be back. Now I just flip them, and I'm gonna let them cook um, a little bit, and then we're gonna add the glaze. Hello, back guys. So here is the final product. I made some of the Uncle Ben's coconut jasmine rice in a bag. I think it's already rice. It's really good. Steamed some broccoli and put some uh, butter, red pepper flakes, salt and pepper. And I got three lamb chops. This is dinner. So I'm done for the day. I'm going to go sit down and eat. And thanks for watching. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you, Elle. And I'll see y'all in the next vlog. Bye. <laughs>